The water buffalo, Mobalis mobalis, is a domesticated animal that humans most depend on. In the early days, they are the backbone of agriculture. Buffaloes are work animals in many countries of Asia and Africa. They plough fields, carry seeds, transport goods, and many more. Because of its large size and dangerous horns, learning about its behaviour and ways of handling is very crucial. Before I start, I would like to express my opinion regarding this subject, VPP3932. Animal behavioural knowledge is an essential component in veterinary practices. Understanding animal behaviour benefits in the safe handling of veterinary patients, as well as play a vital role in the diagnosis of animal health and welfare concerns. The ability to identify pain and distress can determine what is the best way to handle them. Failure to understand this concept could result in hazardous consequences. As so, VPP3932 will help us to better understand the importance of this component to carry ourselves when facing such animals in the future. Water buffalo behaviour is very similar to cattle, with the exception of the wallowing behaviour, which significantly differentiates between these two species. These large bovines require only one factor to survive in a particular habitat. As the name suggests, water buffalo are quite fond of water and like to submerge themselves whenever possible to cool down their body. This is due to their physical characteristic and lack of sweat glands. Buffalo also appear to have better memories than cattle. They never forget, making this beast quite a vengeance seeker. That's why they never forgive. Poor handling can often result in long-term difficulties. The impact of this are that buffalo should be handled expertly from the start. Which brings us to the second part of the video, ways to handle. The flight zone is a distance within which a person can approach an animal before it moves away. Buffalo eyes have a very wide field of vision which correlate with their instinct to escape from predators. Knowing where to stand and backing off when needed to reduce pressure is the basics of flight zone. Intruding too far into the flight zone elevates stress level and makes the animal's movement more unpredictable. Next, blindfold has traditionally been used by ancient Egyptians to reduce reactivity of buffalo, therefore facilitating the process of handling and manipulation of the animal. The use of blindfold is a method that reduces the level of fear through the elimination of human proximity. Stressful handling practices are detrimental to both animal welfare and production. By benefiting squeeze shoot, handler can apply even pressure with a squeeze shoot, allowing the buffalo to remain upright and balanced. Thus, buffalo can be effectively and safely restrained in squeeze shoot. Therefore, proper technique may not only help facilitate handling this animal, but can also improve their welfare.